because right now we have got our first we guest do. in the studio and I think that's what's important and that's that what we should important. focus yes. on. We have jean Wete in the hey. building. Hey. What is going on? Welcome to the studio, man. Thanks for having me. If you were not here, what would you be doing on a Friday night? Uh, Probably at home. Be um, truthful. No, yeah, no. Be I'm, honest I'm, with us. No, so my this is a safe space. No, We're all friends now. Literally. Um, there's two places. I'm, I'm either at home just watching stuff on my laptop or probably a friend's house drinking. Okay. Yeah. Drinking or watching. Wh- I like that. Wine. I like wine. Okay. Red well, wine. You like wine? White, white or red? Okay. Red. I'm over well, red. Well, what's red your favourite wine? Good Malbec? Yeah. Do you see how I said that? I, I don't even, even drink. I can't even drink. I don't even drink. I, I used to work at a Malbec. restaurant. So, you know, I don't okay, yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm literally, I'd, yeah. So it's, it's like, if it's, if it's Friday, I don't really pick. I'm not really, I'm so not. So you drink a little something before you go to the studio? Yeah. Yeah, you yeah, do. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. why your eyes look a little glazed, <laughs> yeah? <laughs> right, listen, I'm coming, coming here looking nervous, you know? They, oh, listen, like I just said, we're all family now. There's no need for nerves in this house. Yeah. Um, thank you for coming in uh, and talking to us. You have an app, you have an idea. Mm-hmm. You're a man with a plan. Yes, exactly. I love a man with a plan. Man so for plan. everyone who ha- hasn't kind of come across Minute, mm-hmm. tell us a little bit about what Minute is and why you started it. Uh, so Minutes is um, it's an app that I've launched about, I think, 11 months now. Okay. 11 months ago. So it's an app that allows you to watch short films. So um, it would kind of go a bit further than that. So you watch short films based on to the time you have available. So let's say you're commuting to work. And I say my commute is uh, 15, minutes. 15 minutes. I can put in the app. Yeah. I've got 15 minutes yeah. and it will play me something, a film end to end yeah. that is 15, 15 minutes, minutes long. long. Yeah, and you can download the film to watch uh, when you're on the tube as well. So, nice. And Amazing. what's so great about this is what is, uh, so I, I worked in industry for like, uh, I think like eight years. What uh, industry? Film industry. Oh, the film industry. The film okay. industry for eight years. Okay. I'm still in my 20s. Okay, uh, all right. Yeah, yeah, I'm not that old. But then, um, Looking young and fresh, <laughs> my friend. I in black, don't crack. Ah, okay. all right, now. Nah. <laughs> I'm going to say that joke. If you, if you had a beard, though, you'd look like me. Oh, 10 yeah, years yeah. plus. You know what's Ryan, funny? please. You know what's funny? So, you know the, uh, the photo that I sent you, I sent you guys? You look yeah. young. Okay, so, can you guess what, when I took that photo? Uh, yesterday. No. I, that photo uh, was taken when I was 16. I'm no 27. Way. No, you do look young in it. I'm not going to yeah, lie. Yeah, you look, you need to update your headshot. I'm not going <laughs> to lie. Uh, if you're going to be out here starting a business and putting your picture all over LinkedIn, no. and I know you put it all over LinkedIn because you tagged me on LinkedIn. <laughs> you need to update that picture real quick. Yeah, exactly. Um, I know you got someone who can take pictures for you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, so. Um, the so joke thing is, though, if we go to your website right now, the image that you've used, you actually got a lot of hair on the top of your head <laughs> and you don't look 16. How old are you using that picture when you had hair on your head? Uh, this is last year. This is last year. Yeah, so you cut the dreads. Yeah, no, I cut the dreads. I, I, went through, I went through weird phases. So, like, uh, I, cut, I I had dreads. I had my hair dyed um, blonde, blue, grey. Okay. All right. Blonde, blue, and grey? No, nice. not all at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> One at a time. One at a time. So, why did you want to come up with this app? What what, what inspired you to start it up? Um, so, like I said, so I, I worked in industry for, like, t- um, for eight years. And one thing I discovered is... Um, a lot of filmmakers, so we you make a film, you mm. make a short film, and then you take it to a film festival. Mm. And then after the film festival, buzz is finished, then yep. you end up putting your film on Vimeo or YouTube. Yep. Yeah. And then the problem with that is uh, on YouTube, nobody cares about your short film. Yeah. YouTube is made for music and other random videos. Mm. And Vimeo is for business. and as a, The occasional Vimeo. short films as well, because uh, yeah, there's a lot of people who develop creative yeah, short yeah. films on, on Vimeo. I've yeah. seen quite a few, but you Vimeo, are right. Vimeo, yes, but not YouTube. Certain people. Y- yeah. You know, so Vimeo, yes. But then the thing about Vimeo is um, is a Vimeo model. So the mm. platform's model is not made for short film. Yeah. It's business. That's mm. what they highlight. Okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then, um, so then I, you know, just like being in the industry, speaking to loads of filmmakers, then uh, every time you speak to someone, it's always a frustration. Oh, I've, I've done my film. Then after the festival thing is done, yep. it's gone. Mm. Then I'm like, then I'm like, I'm so I'm sitting there, been in industry for, for like, I don't know, at the time it was about maybe five years. Mm. Then I'm like, whoa, this is a real problem. What has anyone ever trying to solve it? What yep. have we not created a platform for filmmakers to express themselves? The same way as we have Spotify for musicians. Oh, good point. And True. this should be a platform purely for short, uh, for filmmakers mm. to just make films and then essentially live off making films so okay. how easy was it to kind of start then because you are the founder and yeah. as a founder it's probably extreme strenuous to try and find the right people mm, we yeah. can see from your website you've been supported by dice yeah. we work like a bunch of people yeah, like yeah. how does that and recently nike or and nike, there you go right yeah. soon to be added to the website yeah, you got yeah, and yeah, maybe yeah. even more moving forward right yeah, who yeah. knows yeah so as a founder how str- how strong did you have to be to be um, resilient to this point um it's, it's, it's quite it's quite a weird one because I think um, 
So I don't know how to code. I don't come from a tech um, industry. Okay. Okay, this is a big revelation. I don't mm. know how to code. So I didn't code the app myself. So I, I'm literally, I'm not a business person. I'm not a techno- technological person. I'm a just filmmaker and a crazy mm. person. So I had that idea and then it's literally just like talking to anyone. Right. So when, when I first started, it, I'll go to loads of uh, tech um uh, events Startups, and yep. startup events and literally go to loads of film events just talking to anyone hey, you know th- what do you think of this idea Is this, mm. what do you think you know then eventually you want to speak to people people start kind of guiding you to the right people that's to talk a good to. that's some good advice and eventually mm. um then i met a few people but it didn't work but then i my business partner julian who's their lead tech so he's the guy who's in charge right. of uh, yeah, yeah. building the actual product Products, yeah and so i found him in the most weirdest <laughs> weirdest way so uh have you guys heard of Cora? No. Cora? No. What is it? So it's, 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 it's like um. It's oh, like, with a Q. The Q. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's it's like Reddit, but oh, um, the yeah. ask questions. Yeah, the ask yeah, questions, yeah, yeah, yeah. So. And um, people ask the randomest stuff. You've random there. stuff. I've never used that thing in my life. I was like, I just wanted to look for someone who knew anything about technology. So then I went. I literally I went everywhere. I went on Twitter. Like ask Jeeves, isn't it? Yeah. Um, is Ask Jeeves still around? No, I don't think so. Yeah. Oh, God. I think it's Quora now. Yeah, <laughs> I, like yellow page and, sh- and stuff. And yeah, apologies yeah, for that. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, so yeah, I so yeah, I, yeah. So I'm on Quora and I typed in. I said, I'm, um, I'm looking for someone who just knows about how to code, how to code, and, yeah. whatever. And then, um, then this guy Julian go back to me. and Goes, hey, you know, I'm not, I'm, I live in London. Just from a question. Just, just, just from a question. Wow. And then, he, then he go back to me. Then I was like, oh, this is, this is weird, man. I don't, I don't want to. Really, I, I don't. This, I've never used this. Thing before platform for you like yeah. my mama told me not to meet strangers off the internet exactly. but you're doing it right exactly. there and there exactly it's like it's, it, literally it's like it's like going on reddit and putting a question and someone mm. say hey let's meet up then so you like, guys then met and yeah so, so then we met then after that then we literally we met in a cafe and he told me he'd never built an app before but he know how to actually uh, build stuff tech okay. stuff and he didn't show me anything but he said i can, I can build this for you mm. and this is from now then we blind faith and blind look faith. what it's, yeah. and look where it's gotten you which is a, yeah, an extraordinary yeah. story yeah for people who, um, and I'm just playing Devil's Advocate because I really please, enjoy please doing that. Yes. Yeah. Why is this different to Netflix? So why is this di- different to Netflix? So we, um, so, if, uh, so one thing I'm going to ask you guys, um, we've all experienced this, okay? Mm-hmm. So you're you're on Netflix, mm-hmm. then you're scrolling, 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 trying to look for something to watch. Mm. Next thing you know, you you spend like 10, 15 minutes just scrolling. 10, 15 minutes? I've been scrolling for an hour at oh, this yeah. point. Ex- exactly. You, you know what I mean? You spend more time scrolling on Netflix than you spend watching, watching the film. <laughs> exactly, exactly. You know? so, so that's the problem with Netflix. So um, Netflix, they tend to be a platform where they just throw everything at you. Mm. You just find whatever you find. So what if I, so do I not have the option on the Minutes app to scroll to see what short film I want to watch or do I just have to put in my time limit? Okay, so no, you, there, there is an option. So you, you put your time limit and it gives you, uh, on the main page, it gives you three films at a time. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. The reason being because we want you to waste less time scrolling mm. and we focus more of in, on your t- the time you have available. So right. what's the difference between us and Netflix is that we're focusing more of your time. Okay. And you have an algorithm then that kind of helps. Again, we, yeah. we sound like we're going to be investing in this right uh, now, Yeah, right? I, I, I bet see you guys investing in this. Uh, <laughs> crowdfunding's coming soon. So do you have an algorithm that kind of helps you find the right type of content on that platform? Um, at the moment, we don't have a... So we, we're, we're kind of staying away from being automated because mm. we want it to be like a handpick and okay. kind of mm. you can't human connection is better than you, you can't get it you can't get it wrong it's, mm. it's always better yeah, than that, uh, this robot automated system we have so at the moment we don't have an uh, automated algorithm but we have a team of people who you go and search for content and they literally speak to uh, filmmakers and we speak to the bfi we speak to other film festival that we have connection with and they give us a list of films and how does this work in terms of is it a subscription model if i want to watch some short films on my mm. way home tonight let's say mm-hmm. do i need to sign up um it's free at the moment Come on. Oh, get it while oh. you get can it, people yes. get it while you can you heard it you here first it's free at the it's moment free at for, the for moment. now the moment, okay. for now christmas time you're gonna get that premium yeah, package exactly, you, exactly. <laughs> you better get it before we start slapping um <laughs> no and actually i really really love that idea because i remember yeah. watching a short film ages ago mm. and it was so moving and it yeah. really struck with me mm. i can't for the life of me find it i've never been wow. able to find yes, it again yes, and yes, it was yes. a international one so it was english subtitles mm-hmm. so i can't remember you know what so our app what we're trying to do we're going to make it a lot easier for people to find short mm. films and so for example so let's say you watch this film you remember how it made you feel you remember the theme of it and Hopefully by the end of next year we'll have an algorithm where you can search by mood. Okay. Oh, by topic. Now that is nice. We're gonna yeah. go even deeper, and I mean I should not say this because my say business it, partner will kill me. You I found him on Quora. It's fine. Yeah, about it. <laughs> I, think, I think I'm gonna keep it here. I don't want to give too much away. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, hold on to it because yeah, we don't want to be it, make yeah. sure we don't want to make you liable in it because yeah, the chorus yeah. gonna take it all. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, exactly. Um, what kind of what stage are you at with it now? How many users do you yeah. have? What's <clears> the grand plan for it? Um, so we've launched already, like I said. So we've got the product running, and we are on the MVP version. So that okay. means it's just a, um, it's Most not the finishing product. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So it's like a beta testing. In a way. Yes, exactly. Yeah. So it's not the finished polished products, which um, we're looking to get it done by the end of um, I think February. Nice. So that's when the finishing. Products okay. Are. Well, listen, I'm going to yeah. sign up to it on Please. on on the way home. Yeah, I'll, yeah. I'll watch something on my way home. Yeah. Um, and what's your dream for this? How uh, big is this going to get? So my dream for it. So there's two there's two things. So I number one I want people kind of like uh, just um, every time you have mm. that you want to watch something and to spend it basically spend it wisely and watch something quality yeah that's one thing and number two is um, I always look at the way uh, the film the music industry kind of run where musician can tour with the with the EP Chance the Rapper oh yep. uh, yeah good, good chance, shout okay, Chance the Rapper all, all these basic, studying. Uh-huh. yeah so yeah so musician can tour with the, with the EP and filmmakers in the future they'll be able to start touring with the short films through your platform through our platform mm. and, and hopefully there'll be other platforms as well so to support uh, is that why you yeah. work with Dice ah uh, see you look at the connection uh, look at the connection I told you this was you a man with a plan here. yeah uh, it was a man with a plan uh, yeah. right. listen this all sounds phenomenal and we wish you the best the best. Be where can people find you where can they mm-hmm. sign up to the app where can they follow you to find out more uh, so we tend to use uh, our instagram like our website okay. our business card so um our instagram is minute.app so that's minute.app that's so easy yeah and yeah. then uh, me personally uh, if you want to slide into my dms John hey. yeah hey. <laughs> Yes, so I see the looks you're getting right now. Yeah, I see <laughs> you getting like, is it? She said, "Is it?" Yeah. Um, so, so respectfully, yeah, yeah. respectfully, slide into Jean Vier's DM. Look at you today. Look at you, bro. <laughs> respectfully, if you could blush. Yeah, no, listen. Yeah. yeah. So if you want to, yeah, get into my um, contact me. So it's Jean Vier Wette. So that's uh, January in French and last name W E T E. You've done, this, you've done this before look at you yeah he knows how to do this press yeah. press circuit listen thank you so much for coming in thank and sharing your dreams me, yeah. Listeners, if you've just tuned in, that was Jean Vier Wete talking about his app Minute, which is all about screening for short films where you can watch short films. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you, bro. Thank you for, thanks for having me. BBC Radio London. This year for BBC.